I'm I'm sure you guys have noticed, but it's been quite a while since I've made any kind of videos about uh, how much I'm making or my income in my notary business. And honestly, that's been quite intentional. Um, it's, it's not that your boy isn't making money, <laughs> but um, I've decided to uh, just not make those kind of videos anymore. Um, and honestly, I feel like it's at this point kind of kind of played out. Um, and that's obviously no shade to any of my other peers and friends here on YouTube in the notary space that are, you know, making those kind of making those kind of videos. I have no issue with it. But for me, um, it's uh, it's just a little old at this point. Um, I think a lot of us have have made those kinds of videos. Um, and even, you know, you hear a lot of the notary trainers and mentors talking about it as well. And again, I have no no issue with that per se uh, but I will say that um, when we as quote-unquote influencers or whatever people that are kind of in in the public space of doing this business um, talk about it I think it brings some of the wrong kind of attention um, it brings uh, you know it, it, it creates unrealistic expectations um, I think in some people, and this is based on the comments I read and kind of the things people are saying, I think it, it creates, you know, some real unrealistic expectations about um, what what it means to run this business, um, getting started in this business, um, you know, gives people the wrong perceptions of, you know, how fast you can make money and, and how much money you can make. Um, and it, it, I, I just don't want to send the wrong messages to people um, again. You know, as we say in real estate, real estate is, you know, hyper local. It's about location, location, location. And to some degree, that's it's very similar in the in the notary business as well. So how much money you can make is going to be driven by by where you are to some degree. So if you're living out in the middle of nowhere um, or in a small town with not a lot of people, um, then it's, you know, foreseeable that you might not be able to make as much money and that all the numbers that uh, many of you know many of us have thrown out there and that you continue to hear are not realistic for you um, so I personally don't want to you know continue to perpetuate you know wrong ideas um, or not not even wrong ideas um, just a perception about uh, how much money you can make uh, when that might not be the reality for everyone now Again, I'm not saying it's anything wrong with talking about it, but people should understand that how much money you can make in this business is just going to be just going to be different. So ten, someone making ten thousand dollars a month, that's not in, in this notary business doing loan signings. It's not normal. People making two hundred fifty dollars a signing. That's that's not necessarily the norm for everyone. Um, and what people a lot of times don't account for um, when you hear these stories is what it took people to get to the point where they're at, where they're making, um, you know, 10,000, 10, 15, 20,000 dollars a month in this business. And what sacrifices are they making? How much driving are they are they doing? How much are they spending? Um, you know, how many signings are they actually doing a day and a month? And, you know, what is it actually cost costing them? Um, you don't hear that discussed as much. You just hear the, the big numbers and that I kind of have an issue with because it, it again creates the wrong perception and it gives people to some degree false hope right uh, now again everyone individually has to manage their own expectations about what uh, what their goals are um, how much money they can make uh, you know how how are other people in their their market doing right um, everyone has to kind of manage their own expectations in that regard but again I don't want to continue to to talk about me personally how much money I'm making one because it's obviously my business uh, and two I, I don't think it I don't think it brings value um, it might you know motivate some people and show people you know and give people uh, proof that it can be done but I um, I just don't want to continue to, to do that you know like <laughs> I'll, I'll get checks you know from direct signings and things like that and I want to post it on 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 here or wherever but then I say you know what that's it's not 
that doesn't add value. It might motivate some people, like I said, but again, it, you know, and that's not to say that I won't ever do that. But again, you know, I'm all about bringing value. Um, and that may or may not motivate some people. Uh, but you know, I just don't want to send the wrong signal and the wrong message. Um, I think a lot of people have jumped out into this business and have, um, quit their jobs, um, and done certain things that, you know, I probably wouldn't have advised people to do. You know, I made a video a while back about not quitting your nine to five. Um, you know, if, if, if your life isn't set up for you to do that just yet, just because you're tired of your boss, you're tired of your, your job or career, and you just want to do something new. Um, it's not smart to just, to just quit. Um, unless again, your life is set up in a way that it can, like you have runway and you have, you know, you have savings or you have a spouse and you, you know, or, you know, a multitude of things. Right. Um, but a lot of people have just jumped out there and quit and started this business and then realized that it's not what they thought it would be. Um, so, and I think part of that, part of the reason why maybe some people have, uh, maybe felt that they could do that is because, you know, maybe they've been maybe slightly misled, um, by what they've heard. Now, again, everyone is their own individual, everyone, all, you know, y'all are grown adults. Y'all can, you know, make decisions on your own, um, and listen to whatever advice you want to listen to or not. But, you know, I just feel like I want to be, um, true to, uh, true to myself and true to um, those of you who are watching this and you know obviously um, you know add value and, and give good advice and 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 show you how to how to build this business but I don't want to you know mislead anyone um, in, intentionally or unintentionally um, but again I'm I'm doing well in my business my business is 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 great like i said um in a couple of videos back i've made some changes so that i can um you know have certain boundaries and 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 make sure that everything that i'm doing is functioning at the highest level i'm still making those changes and those adjustments um in my businesses uh, but um you know i'm i'm okay with where not satisfied with where i am but i'm okay with uh the approach and the perspective i have to to this business um so that's why i haven't made any videos talking about uh money um because it's just i'm personally just kind of kind of over it um and it, those I, and i know those videos they get they get the most views they attract the most you know attention and things like that but at the end of the day what's most important is that if you're in this business that you know what you're doing um and that you are a, a good notary a good loan signing agent and that you're operating at the highest level in this business. Um, and if you're doing that, the money will come, the business will come, the relationships will come. Um, and that's, that's just a fact. So, um, I just wanted to make this quick video to kind of share my thoughts on, on this whole thing about people sharing, um, their income again, no, no shade. And I'm not coming for anyone, um, you know, individually or whatever. Uh, but I personally just don't feel like, uh, that adds value um, you guys can comment down below and let me know differently I'm still probably not gonna do any of those videos uh, like I said but um, comment down below let me know your thoughts I know a lot of you are probably pretty passionate about this for one reason or another um, so just wanted to chat with you guys uh, from the heart about that and I'll see you guys in the next video peace